Roomies, it's been a while since a rap beef has had our timelines in a chokehold quite like this, and things only seem to be escalating. What started out as a featured track from Drake and J. Cole quickly turned into an all-out rap beef brawl with Kendrick Lamar, Rick Ross, Future, Metro Boomin, and more. But could this be deeper than rap? His all the two we have so far, so you know. The rap beef seemingly started after Drake released his track First Person Shooter featuring J. Cole, where they refer to themselves as the big three of this generation of rap rappers alongside Kendrick Lamar. In one of J. Cole's bars, he says, Love when they argue, the hardest MC. Is it K-Dot, is it Aubrey or me? We the big three like we started a league. This clearly did not sit well with Kendrick because after he clapped back on Future and Metro Boomin's joint album, We Don't Trust You. On one of the tracks titled Like That, Kendrick took shots at Cole and Drake. He also rapped, Mother the big three, it's just big me. Kendrick's clap back didn't go unanswered for long though, because J. Cole responded with a Kendrick diss and seven minute drill. However, he took fans by surprise when he got on stage a week later and not only apologized for it, but removed it from streaming services altogether. Fans were quick to chime in about his decision as well. One fan wrote, there's no way J. Cole could be a rapper from up north dissing someone in retaliation and then apologize. You will be disowned and they gonna try you just because you look soft now. Can't wear the jersey if you're not repping the home team properly. Another fan wrote, was J. Cole on shrooms or something? This album is way fire. Why the f did he apologize. The beef seems only to be beginning though because since the drama began, fans have speculated that Future, Rick Ross, Metro Boomin, and The Weeknd all have issues with Drake as well. And the speculations were only fueled when Drake's latest track, Push Up, where he took shots at Kendrick Lamar, Rick Ross, and The Weeknd and others leaked online. And just hours later, Rick Ross popped out with a diss track of his own on his track titled Champagne Moments. He made fun of Drake's alleged plastic surgery and referred to him as a white boy. Drake has hasn't musically responded to Ross yet, but the two have definitely been going back and forth throwing shots at one another on social media. Ross taunted Drake via his Instagram stories and Drake posted DMs that he sent to Rose talking trash about the square footage of his property saying his Star Island house is on a sliver of cheesecake. Some fans are speculating that rappers are turning on Drake for different reasons. Joe Budden recently spoke out on an episode of his podcast and claimed he thinks Ross could be upset that Drake may secretly have ownership stake in Gamma Records, the label to which Rick Ross and MMG are signed. Fans on social media also have their own thoughts on what could be going on. One fan wrote, I'm pretty sure this Drake rap beef is fabricated. It's kind of out of nowhere, but it's working. Genius marketing strategy, all this fake and these is still he he and with each other offline. J. Cole was the only not in on it. That's why he apologized. Another fan wrote, Drake trolling everybody on social media while Kendrick is probably somewhere with no Wi-Fi reading books. This rap beef is cooked. What are your thoughts, roomies? Could there be more to the sudden influx of Drake hate? And who do you think is going to win when this is all said and done? Roommates, thanks for watching TSR So You Know of the Week. Share your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to subscribe. Keep watching so you know.